everybody, Cindy Otter here. Um, I have another small little journal flip through to do for you. Um, I do these when I'm on the couch and when I um, have pain days. This is a small journal, I'll be honest with you, I can't remember who sent it to me. And basically it's held together with one piece of wax string. Let me show it to you. Right there. So these are all removable. But I did work on them um, just as a whole journal. So it was kind of challenging at times. But here we go. I love, I love this lady. I just, I found a bunch of pictures of her and I cut them out. They're all black and white. And she, she just makes me laugh every time I see her. So yeah, this is just play. Um, you know, when I sit at the couch and I, I'm watching something or... You know, just trying to chill for the night, whatever. Um, this is stuff that I do. Someone loves you. I have no idea what this mess is. Just says, turn back time. Apparently, that's what I was thinking <laughs> when I did that page. This says, weekend badass. And, of course, it's a drink and a cacti. cacti. Um, shine brightly. She's pretty. Don't know. This is it. You know. I just, I play. I just play around. Embrace change. Um, this one I think is cool. Beauty. This is a Dina Wakely um, girl. She wondered if she was dreaming. Again, another Dina Wakely. I believe this is a Dina Wakely uh, one out of one of her books of paper. Storms Don't Last Forever. Find beauty the ordinary way. Um, that one just says learning. Is that what that says? Yep, learning. <laughs> A little bit of alcohol ink. I don't know why I pulled this out of my stash somewhere. And it just says space. Put a tag on here. I mean, nothing crazy. This is friendship. See how some of the pages are just, you know, they're, I love it. I love this journal. Um, I love the organic nature of it. And that's why I just, I didn't really do a lot of special things with it. I just had fun playing in it. Um, love. No idea this says yay for today. Don't know. Just whatever. Your heart is where your home is. I'm sorry, your heart is your home. I apologize. Uh, this little gal, happiness is homemade. Um, these things, this tree you see right here, what these are is a coloring book that I got a long time ago. And I would sit at night and color. And normally what I did is I used Sharpies on it. And when I turned it over, of course, these are one-sided. When I turned it over, I really like the back side better than the front side. Um, this one actually is a front side, but I've used the back sides before. A lot of fun. Hello Spring. Um, this, I can't remember where I was sitting. I was sitting somewhere and, um, oh, I know, I was out in Nebraska with a friend of mine. Um, and there was this paper sitting there and I just started scribbling and doodling. And then I brought it home and stuck it in here. Uh, Snoopy Love. Love this flower. Love. This is actually a sheet of um, labels that I had done a bunch of painting on. So I just took the sheet off, stuck them down, and put the flower on, and there you go. Reach for the stars. This little guy came out of a magazine. I thought he was cute. I'm too busy eating. <laughs> uh -uh. This one says artistic. He's coming off, but that's all right. Oh, excuse me, artistic adventures. They go together, I think. I don't know. Humble beginnings. Love these flowers. A friend of mine sent me a, um, a little mystery box, and these flowers were in there, and I just fell in love with them. Make art. Let the sun shine in. Best is yet to come. I was just playing with paint on that one. Looks like there's 
Right, here it is. Hang on. That one just says perfect. I like this. I'm not sure why. I like the color palette of this. I just think it's it's really pretty. When you take everything else away, let me show you. you. Take everything else away, and you just have this. It didn't quite work, but anyways, see what I'm saying? I just love the color palette of that. I think it's really pretty. Just my craziness. Um, <laughs> playing with my art supplies. That was just a sticker that I had. No idea. Again, a Mod Podge of things. It says the sky's the limit. Here's more of those. These are little labeled, the little square labels. Um, again, I had played with them with um, paint and then just stuck them down here and all this stuff went over it. So. I love this. Sorry, I have to get a quick drink. It's big, better, and best. Um, this is something that um, Peg Robinson did, and she sent me a few of these. And I, I just love this fish. I think he's so cool. So he's there. Uh, believe in your selfie. So yeah, I like this again. Dina Wakely. My little um, seahorse. Is that it? Seahorse. Yeah. He's just hanging out. He's not saying anything. I gotta glue him back down again. Um, dreams come true. This page, I, I could not cover up these little guys. Let me see if you can see them. See the little kids there in that carriage. Even though it's got paint and stuff on it, I don't even know where that came from. But I just stuck these two colors here, and I just couldn't cover them up. I think they're so cute. And I really didn't want to go in and ruin the picture. Oh, and there's the little horse. I don't know if you can see the horsey. He's right there. Um, I didn't want to go in and ruin the picture by trying to outline it or color it or any of that. So I just left it as it is. I really like it. Uh, be brave. <laughs> if you ever need a slightly distracted, unsym unsympathetic friend, I am here for you. And I just thought these, uh, Dan I think these are Daniel Torrente stamps. I thought they were really cool together. <laughs> My little sense of humor there. Um, let's see, just paints, a little butterfly that came off a stamp for 70 cents. Don't cry over spilt milk, just drink wine. That's funny, I haven't drank wine and I can't tell you how long. And I have like three or four bottles in the fridge. I'll have to get one of them out someday. Um, Born to be free. This was a club, uh, not a club, it was a mailing that I was in. Um... If I can ever remember the name of the group, I will put it in the description box below. But what this this gal did is she sent you a whole bunch of different um, uh, little pieces of components like this that were completely done. So you could just put them on your pages. And they were really cool. There was a lot of really cool stuff in there. A lot of butterflies, some paper clips, some tags, um, little dress on a girl. I mean, just really cool stuff. If I remember the name of it, I will definitely put it in. I'm not promising. My memory shot. Um, this one just says Survivor. It says Story, Memories, and Heartfelt. You guys all recognize that. I'm sure that's a Di uh, Diane Reevely. I think my guardian angel drinks. I don't know. <laughs> it says Make Today Amazing. And I just like this little girl. I didn't want to color her in. I thought with her being black and white, I like her better that way. Um... Home is where the heart is. Just kind of cool. Uh, this gal, she's a stamp, I believe, that I have. Yeah, she's a stamp I have. Um, photograph. She had a camera with her hands, you know. Nothing crazy, just original. Art lover. Um, this is tissue paper that I actually stamped these, the cone flowers, on. And I didn't want to color them, so I just did them all in the black. I thought they were cool. This gal, I think this is a Dina Wakely. Um, let me show you guys what I'm talking about. These are the Dina Wakely books that I use. I've got the volume one and two, and um, they're collage collectives. And so this is cardstock. I use this for tags. 
but the paper that's in the front, I use the this in my art journal. Now I may take just a little piece here and there um, and cut it out, but this is what I use when, when I say Dina Wakely, this is where I've gotten it from. Again, there's just so much here. I mean, I could cut these all out and use them in my junk journal, um, you know, anything like that. So that's where this stuff comes from. Uh, if you're looking for those books, you can find them pretty much anywhere. Um, they, they're made by Ranger, so you can also go to their site. Um, Live Life in Color. This Again, this is a stamp that I have. Uh, it is on tissue paper. I slept it down here, and then I just colored it in with some different pens and stuff. Um, the best medicine for pain is the presence of another person. You guys know um, I live in chronic pain 24-7 which is chronic pain um, and you know it does help to have somebody around and I'll tell you my husband is amazing for that so I thought that was fitting live free and let be little fishy just a bunch of purple stuffs I thought it was cute um, I made a huge lit huge to-do list for today I just can't figure out who's going to do it <laughs> that's me every day this, again, this is a stamp I have. Um, I wanted to leave her white. Yeah, she'd probably look really pretty colored in. But, you know what? I just left it and her name is Priscilla. No idea where I got that sticker from, but that's her name. And then this little gal here. Um, this is a... Um, sorry. Stencil that I have. And I just colored it in, cut it out, and, you know, I have all these gold dots on it. And then this little girl here, I thought she was so cute with the little angel wings. And it says she was a beautiful child. The end. All right, guys, so um, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below. And until next time, bye-bye.